Well, it certainly goes without saying, this endeavor will not be easy. So, you want to become a billionaire, do you? Just 2,668 of them have the privilege of calling themselves a billionaire. Out of the 8 billion humans occupying this planet, collectively, they're worth more than $12.7 trillion. Fewer than 2,000 are considered to be self-made. And in many cases, that self-made label is about as legitimate as an FTX due diligence report. And in this cadre of filthy rich individuals, roughly a third of the world's billionaires inherited at least some portion of their wealth and drastically increase your billionaire chances. And as you can imagine, amassing this amount of money is very statistically unlikely. So it goes without saying, being born into a certain family, but it's not impossible. If you are a man born in the United States or China, well, you're already off to a flying start. About half of the billionaires on the planet come from one of these two countries. However, there are still quite a few self-made billionaires out there. The United States leads this stat by housing 724 billionaires. To put that into perspective, you can count the number of billionaires reigning from Canada with just two hands, 628 of whom were born there. But these are just pesky demographic statistics. And it's not about who you are, it's about what you do. And yes, unfortunately, the disparities continue to stack up, as just 10% of billionaires are women. A millionaire, certainly, but becoming a billionaire, explained the Dallas Mavericks owner to NPR, simply takes a whole lot of luck. Otherwise, everyone would be rolling in the dough. I mean, becoming rich is just not that simple. Becoming a billionaire is so difficult, but someone's always getting lucky. And many people will test out that luck on things like the lottery. For one, your odds of even winning the lottery are roughly 1 in 300 million, which is a very slim chance if you ask me. Sure, winning big on the old Powerball can catapult you into an enormous head start on your billionaire journey, but it's not as easy as it sounds. You're actually more likely to get struck by a meteorite from space than you are to win one of these instant wealth boosters. And oh, do people love to try. You'll always hear the stories of starry-eyed gamblers looking to quintuple their net worth at the casinos of Las Vegas. But alas, it sure is tempting not to at least try. It's immensely improbable to turn a little into a lot in this town. You see, Vegas casinos generally only have about $100 million in reserve cash for the floor. You'd still only be about one-tenth of the way to the billion dollar mark. Meaning that even if you manage to clean out the entire casino, finding ancient artifacts and lost treasures could surely give your net worth a hefty jumpstart. In fact, only a few years ago, a shipwreck was discovered on the bottom of the Caribbean Sea. Maybe you're more of an adventurous person, and you'd like to try your luck at good old-fashioned treasure hunting. That's right, you just have to hope the finder's keeper's rule will hold up. As most discoveries like this one cause a lot of turmoil with the local governing bodies, so perhaps sticking to land might better suit your fancy. It contained more than $22 billion worth of gold. There's loads of precious minerals, metals, and unknown treasures that exist right beneath our very feet. 15 out of the top 100 billionaires in the world built their fortune on metals and mining. If you happen to find some diamonds by chance, you might really be in business, and the industry isn't hitting rock bottom anytime soon. The biggest and most expensive diamond ever found is the Cullinan Diamond. Discovered in South Africa around the early 1900s, as the industry is not only very lucrative, but also very competitive. And this mineral is currently valued at over $400 million. And that's probably just a low-end guesstimate, which could surely give you a nice boost in becoming a famed billionaire. So maybe perhaps you, dear viewer, could find a stone even more rare. And if you're not feeling too Indiana Jonesy, then maybe you could try your hand at professional sports. Out of every pro athlete to ever do it, less than 10 have managed to earn at least $1 billion in career earnings. It is tougher than you think, though. If you want to make the big bucks, you have to be the best. And I mean cream of the crop. 
We're talking about names like Cristiano Ronaldo, guys like Tiger Woods, Michael Jordan, and LeBron James, Roger Federer, Lionel Messi, and even Floyd Money Mayweather. And even then, only a select few athletes today are active billionaires. But if sports just isn't your thing, perhaps you could give a go at something more traditional. Well, roughly 15% of billionaires achieved their wealth in finance and investing. Maybe something more tried and tested to give yourself the best chance at accruing at least 1 billion bucks. So how does one reach billionaire status via investing? Well, I can tell you it's just a bit north of buying Dogecoin on Robinhood. <laughs> With Warren Buffett the richest among them, these 393 people have more than just a keen eye when it comes to investments. The billionaire echelon is at such an unreachable level, just doesn't fit the bill for these finance aficionados, that even otherwise solid investment advice, buy low and sell high, sure, but don't just buy low, buy early. But if you want to be a billionaire from investing, time the market. Time the market perfectly. Invest in Amazon when Jeff Bezos is still rocking the sweater vests. Buy when no one has heard of the company you're investing in. Don't just invest in Amazon at its pre-pandemic low. And don't just sell high. Sell at the peak, as in Mount Everest type of peak. Do you like games? Well, I can tell you this much, a lot of people do. Tim Sweeney, founder of Epic Games, did exactly that. Building the next big game could set you up with some major cash. Tim amassed a fortune of over $7.5 billion. Even to this day, the video game is still bringing in over $5 billion a year in revenue. That's a whole lot of arcade tokens. With the creation of Fortnite, the most played video game ever made, and the cash flow doesn't look like it's slowing down anytime soon. The global video game market is valued at over $220 billion and is expected to continue to grow in the future. Maybe you're looking for something a little more out of this world. Billions upon billions of dollars worth of iron, silver, gold, and other undiscovered elements are out there just waiting to be collected. Well, there are untold riches awaiting to be plucked from every asteroid in our solar system. Or perhaps you're more interested in the metaverse than the old-fashioned real world. People like Elon Musk, Jeff Bezos, and Richard Branson already have a head start on this with their own outer space transportation companies. Well, there is an abundance of opportunity in this quickly growing cyber industry. Look at the team from Artifact, who had the idea of building a fully digital fashion and collectible brand only a few years ago. A new virtual world is being created, and there's endless possibilities of what can be accomplished within it in an excess of $1 billion. Putting pen to paper one of the biggest metaverse company acquisitions ever. You could even use your creativity to invent a new toy or gadget. Fast forward a few months and a few different concepts, and the amazing Slinky toy was born. Since its creation, over 350 million Slinkies have been sold worldwide. Maybe like Richard James, who accidentally dropped a tension spring he was working on and saw it slink away across the floor. This is just one of many wacky ideas that started as just a thought and ended up turning into quite a fortune. Always remember, if you can think it, it can be done. Take Bernard and Murray Spain, for example. Within the first year, they had sold over 50 million smiley face buttons and other products. These brothers decided to copyright the yellow smiley face that we all know and love. Just this simple image is earning them an estimated profit of $500 million per year which I'm sure puts quite a big smile on their faces, and began producing yellow smiley novelty items with the tagline, have a happy day. But if you want a surefire path to becoming a billionaire, find a worldwide problem and fix it. Sounds simple enough, right? It's quite simple, really. Make the world a better place. Maybe things like an environmentally safe alternative to plastic. Well, unfortunately, some of these problems are enormously difficult to solve. Or even worldwide internet access. Optimization of food production. Harnessing a new limitless energy source. Whether you're thinking inside or outside the box, 
The opportunity is there for the taking. If you can identify and solve a major problem, you will surely find yourself some major dough. Devise a plan and attack, as only the strong survive, but the wisest thrive. And trust me, it's even harder to maintain that status than you might think. But I digress. To be a billionaire, you have to stay hungry and motivated. You can't allow yourself to waste time, or the time will inevitably waste you. It takes hard work, determination, and a bit of sheer luck to find yourself in the position of being worth billions. Who knows, maybe the world's next billionaire is watching this video right now. So, if you think you have a billion dollar idea, let me know in the comment section down below.